Well, the Rockets have won game one of the Western Conference Finals. Yeah, it's just more of what you'd expect. Um, they, let, they let Clay Thompson get a lot of shots. You know, they did a good job containing Stephen Curry. Or maybe Stephen Curry just contained himself. I don't know. But Kevin Durant went pretty much ham. Nick Young had some pretty big shots. and You know, they're, they're pretty evenly matched in some areas. But the only real difference here is Steph. I mean, sorry. only real difference here is Kevin Durant, you know. Clearly... If the Warriors didn't have Kevin Durant, you know, they, the Rockets would have a chance. But as we can see, Gordon stepped up, did some stuff. To go deep into the bench. We can also see, uh, where's Joe Green? Oh, he only has six points. Seems like he had more than that. But then James Harden with 41 points. I mean, that's big. Kind of like Kevin Durant, 37, but that's still... A lot. Curry at 18. Clay at 28. Chris Paul is 23. So, I mean, this this score won't tell you everything that happened in the game. I mean, the box score won't tell you everything that happened in the game. Final score again is 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 what happened in the game. The Warriors, I think, at times they had you know better team play. They were moving the rock more than the the Rockets. They, they had more of a stagnant offense. More. Isolation, one scoring the ball without passing it. So, yeah, the the Rockets need to work on the, the assist, keeping the assist totals up, not just for, not just for assist sake, but also for people just passing the ball, and getting a better shot opportunity, like the Warriors normally do. But this also leads me to yesterday's game with the Cavs. It got routed by 25, you know, LeBron only had 15, so, yeah, you look at the score and you're like, you know, it, it's really, LeBron said he's like 0% worried, I mean, you can tell it was a feel-out game from the very beginning. I, I wouldn't be so confident, again, mo even the Celtics coach was Brad Stevens, coach of the year, of course, excellent coach. Admitted that there's going to be almost uh, a heavyweight uh, punch by the Cavs the next game. So that's going to be about tomorrow in a few hours. But as we see the box score, a lot of people stepped up. Jalen Brown is, is, is always very good as well as Jason Tatum. Marcus Morris actually really did do good at containing the Cavaliers. Sort of keeping his promise with that whole LeBron thing. kind. I think it was more of a team effort. And now Horford, of course, is the all-star with 20 points. You look at here, you're like, well, you know, maybe if Marcus Morris didn't step up, it would have been like that. So, yeah, I'd have to, have to still pick the Cavs in six. I'm sorry, guys. The Cavs are going to win in six games, but, yeah, I'm going to get some sleep, guys. Good night.